coming off of a really strong season from last year. Um, so I think we're all like really excited. I think the expectations are pretty high. We definitely want to make it to playoffs and make it as far there as we possibly can. Um, and we did lose some, like obviously, some really key players, but we just came in with eight of the like most talented freshman class I've ever seen. Um, I think Ursinus and FNM are usually our biggest um, competition. They usually win the conference, and um, last year we really gave them a challenge, and I think this year it'll be really exciting to see what we can do with all our great players and freshmen. Um, I think Johns Hopkins is always a big one for us because we always get really <laughs> competitive with them, um, and that's after fall break, so we'll all be like really fresh and excited to play. And then um, Dickinson, because we've had like a, at least the four years we've been here, we've had like really like it'll be like 5-1 either way with Dickinson and we lost to them um, last year in the playoffs and we really want to win <laughs> this year and we can. Yes. So I think uh, for us as captains this year and every year really our role is really important in supporting the girls both on and off the field um, and really pushing through the idea and supporting our uh, core team values of communication, honesty, and hard work. Um, this year we're really trying to get the team to bond together, get all the girls to know each other, and that means going to meals together, spending time together off the field, and really just becoming a lot more like a family, and our job is definitely to just keep the family as happy as we can and to really push each other to do the best that we can. Absolutely. Okay. So first of all, the Haverford field hockey community is one of the most inclusive, fun, and exciting teams on campus, in our opinion. Um, <laughs> our games are definitely very fun to watch. We're going to be the fittest team in the conference this year. We have great skills, so every game is going to be close if it's not a blowout because we're winning. <laughs> um, we also have a killer warm-up mix, so if people want to come out early and just jam, <laughs> we're the place to be.